Guys, welcome back to NYC Pops, and we hit the loot today because um, I was watching uh, Top Pops video the other day. I already knew about Gemini collectibles, but I never thought of checking out their clearance section. And we hit it big. Come join me to see what I picked up, which is basically the whole clearance out. So let's go. All right, guys, so this box is huge, it's super heavy, and it's not dented. And as I say that, I see a little dent in there. But they use a U-line box. Shout outs to Gardier Pops, uh, AKA Ross, because he always promoting U-line, even though they're not paying him for it. But I do see what he means with, those are the best heavy duty boxes to ship through. They are, they're amazing. So here we have, ooh, I even got some sorters. I am not happy because I already see some packing peanuts. But um, let me get this out of there. <laughs> Guys, it's two sheets worth of the information of what I ordered. So uh, why packing peanuts, man? Why packing peanuts? All right guys, so the only way I could do this and not make the video super long is I'm gonna show you everything I got and I guess I just leave the PPG down on the side because this video will take forever. But everything I got here, other than sodas, cause I ordered some sodas, every pop I got here was $5.99. So technically half off of retail, cause retail is more or less around 11 to $13, I want to say, for regular pops. There is some exclusives in here too, I believe. And I got some sodas because they had them for $11.99. That's the best retail price you could find them for, unless they're on sale. But $11.99 was great, and I needed those sodas, so I picked them up. Gemini Collectibles, check them out. And I'm not sponsored. All right, guys, so the first pop I got, wait a minute. I don't remember doing this. Huh. I swear I do not remember ordering Hank from Evolve. But he does look an awful lot like Desi from Gears of War. So maybe I wasn't paying attention and that's who I thought I was ordering. Um, that is very possible. But we got Hank from Evolve 39. Most definitely a future giveaway or up for trade because... I don't want that. I I was not paying attention. Uh, this one, also $5.99, like I said, everything was. The box is in great shape. We got Wenpool. And you know I'm trying to rack up as much marble as I can. Let me take these boxes out. I like how they seal those boxes up. That's pretty cool. Let me take this out. All right, so it's getting a little uncomfortable for me right now. We have a soda. This soda was $11.99. It's rock steady. We have a little box of sodas, I believe. That's cool. I never had a, a whole six pack of sodas. And we have, oh, I forgot I ordered this guy. American Horror Story, Horror Story, Holden. I used to be a big fan of American Horror Story. $5.99, man. It may be the only American Horror Story pop I ever have, but it was $5.99. Every other pop is crazy expensive. And the last one in the box, the box is a little bubbled up, a little, not dented, but a little blown up. Squiddly Diddly from Hanna-Barbera. And I love me some Hanna-Barbera. That was also $5.99 like everything else in here. All right, now that I moved out the way, let's get the sodas over with because as you know, I will not be opening the sodas in this video. So they packed it up real nice. I like how they took the time to try to put everything together in the safest way to be shipped for me. So, even some cardboard on top, huh? So, I got Rocksteady. Got me one of those because I want to have the whole set for TMNT sodas and 
the pops. But for the retro collection, I'm not gonna get the original ones. Got myself a Beetlejuice. He's kind of light. Got me a Harley Quinn soda. Because you know what's crazy? I'm thinking I don't have any, but no, I don't. I don't think I do. So got me a Harley Quinn soda. Got me a Sonic soda, hoping that's the chase, because he's flocked. Got me Quick Draw McGraw. And guys, I got me three of these because I am most definitely hoping to get the chase. Um, I would love to have El Cabong. I forgot for a second. I definitely want to get El Cabong. And they kind of weigh the same, so I'm hoping I don't have the same figure. I definitely want to have both of them. I love when sodas have two different characters. The commonest one and the chase in this example is going to be his alter ego, El Cabong. They've done that with a few sodas. So I'm hoping I have both because I'm not going to be buying more. Another example of that is Superman. They got Superman and then Bizarro is the Chase, which is a whole different character. All right, guys, you guys saw these, so let me get these out the way. Let's do the box that has red tape on it for some reason. $5.99 for everything, man. $5.99. Okay, I see. I think this is going to be my favorite one. So we got... I used to watch this all the time. We got the Phantom. I know he's out in a few different colors. I used to watch this show. Um, we also have another Hanna-Barbera, Sneasley, from Brizzly and Sneasley. I got to get the other guy for show. And in the back, we have a bunch of Hanna-Barbera characters. Um, who else we got here? Oh, <laughs> I got to get the other guy. I have the other guy, Breezley. So that's cool. I really must have not been paying attention. I picked this one up, Poe, um, because it was $5.99. Most likely for trade or giveaway in the future. I also picked up Firestorm. Ooh, it's a little slightly damaged. Nothing crazy. Picked up two of these. This one is better. Because I want to give one out. And yeah, I know me. I love DC and Marvel. More Marvel than DC. But um, out of everything I saw, this was my favorite one. So I was like, let me just pick up two and then I could do a giveaway for one of them. Or a trade. If y'all hit me up with a trade before I post it for a giveaway, I could trade too. We're up to the last box. Got a lot of 5.99 pops. And there was some that I didn't pick up because they don't fit my collection or I didn't really care for them. So yeah, there's a lot more than what you've seen. Okay, so here we have Walgreens exclusive. Punisher 2099. We also have, I think this is a really good pickup, Superman Soldier. I have not seen the movie, but I find this really, really cool. So I got Superman Soldier 599. You already know it. I like this one a lot for some reason. Why? I don't know, but I just, I like him a lot. And let me take this one out first. And we got Power Girl, which I've never heard of, but um, is a DC character, so I decided to pick her up. Got a little, got a little damage in the front, but it is what it is. And then we got this combo three pack, which I'm surprised I got this for $5.99. The Penguin Imposter. We have Harley Quinn and Poster. And lastly, we have Scarecrow and Poster. And I like all of these. I have seen all of them. I know there's about four more, if I'm not mistaken. But I like all of these. And I know I have another one that I have to open. And I would like to get the whole set. There is seven of them. There's Two-Face, the Penguin, Harley Quinn, Scarecrow, 
The Riddler, I think the Riddler is an exclusive, so that one might be hard to get. Poison Ivy is definitely gonna be hard to get. And Harley Quinn, which is basically a background poster. So guys, let me know what you think about this haul. I cleaned out the house at Gemini Collectibles. Let me know if you're interested. If you didn't know about that sale that the pops are $5.99 on clearance, you should go check it out. You might find something you like. I picked up everything I like and apparently even something I didn't need or wanted. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, leave a comment down below, letting me know if you knew about this sale or you're going to go check them out now. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you for watching.